All right, we are recording. Continuing in Deus Ex Mankind Divided. Um, so I've got an errand kind of thing in about an hour and a quarter. So, yeah, I set the 30 minute timer going. Um, I can go a little bit past, uh, half hour, but yeah, I'm going to try to keep these a little bit shorter, which for this one shouldn't be too bad because I don't, I, I, I've got side missions I want to do. <clears throat> oh, and by the way, one thing, because I mentioned in the previous part the idea of having game where side quests are morally repugnant to see how people react. And also just, you know, give them options. As I said even then, it's, there's going to be plenty of people that will just, well, it's in the game, I want to do everything in the game. And, it's, and th th there's no judgment there. I mean, it's like, that. that's, I totally understand. Um, but I do want to add that... You couldn't do that in a game that's already, like, um, already has you doing morally questionable things. So, like, you couldn't do that in GTA, in a GTA game, because that's just what the shtick is already. Um, <clears throat> oh, I thought I had come in here and gotten everything. Um, so it would be more so a game like this, where... You are actually trying to... There, it is reasonable that Jensen... To say that Jensen is trying to be a good man. A good moral man. And at times is in a situation where... That, is, that choice is not completely available to him. Oh. Yeah, I'll get down a different way. <clears throat> Yes. Um. Yeah. for my inventory is full. <clears throat> ah, here it is. And that would have been nice to have earlier. Alright. Do it this way. Oh, I said in Q. How is this the situation I'm in? And holy crap, after we do all that. Damn it. I'm sorry, but why would that have set people off? <clears throat> oh, I didn't know that. Typhoon can be modified to use gas cloud ammunition. I have no recognition. No. No recognition? I don't remember that being the case. Alright, um. What does that Come on, there we go. Everyone, stay calm. <clears throat> okay. I mean, I can't say you're wrong, but... Oh, 
Let, let's do what we can for them, just the same. Always causing trouble. Down this one. I do want to see where that will take me. I, have not done anything <clears throat> I want to take care of this first. Rozmyslete si, co dělá. Anomaly detected. Trace program initiated. What? Seriously? I can do something that would be an absolute waste, but I'll still do it just because. Why not? Wait, where is it? What? Okay. I know my right. This is an illegal arrest. You cannot do this. Also, another way in here. Žádný z nich nemá důvod vycházet z těch lečtů. I hadn't gone through here. Does this take me? Aha. Okay. 
Oh, I'm, yeah, I may have actually already seen this, but just, oh, it's going down, I'm not doing it. Because I was trying to go up. Damn cult. Man, this place has a lot of vents. Oh yeah, okay. I did forget about about this. This is an illegal The Avatar. There's all kinds of crazies out there. That's where it went in. Okay. Oh wait, that's just trying to like get me out of here. Is <clears throat> which I do not want to do. Not yet, anyway. Um, yeah, and I'll wait. I'll wait on that. Adam, it's Arya. I just heard what happened. God, right outside your apartment? What happened outside my apartment? Someone got all their implants torn out. Was left to bleed to death in the alley. When I first heard where it was, I thought... I'm fine, Arya. It wasn't me. Be careful going home. It's not the first one of these I've heard about. You hear? Talos Rucker's dead. I heard that somewhere, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <clears throat> Pretty cool, right? Now we can get some real progress. He was making us look like wimps. That's a little harsh, isn't it? Rucker didn't deserve what happened to him. Something tells me our politics aren't the same, Jensen. Me, I think this whole martyr thing is exactly what we need. But, um... Uh... Let's maybe focus on things we can agree on, huh? Like optimizing that uh, crazy rig of yours. You got a calibrator for me or what? You really think Rucker was the problem? That his death is somehow gonna make things better for Augs? I don't think he was the solution. We need a new leader. Someone a little less beardy, McFancy diploma. Someone who's gonna fight, you know? Stand up to some of these bullshit laws. You hear about the Human Restoration Act? Yeah. If the restoration vote passes, I don't know that it's gonna matter very much who the leader is. It's gonna be a government-mandated horror show is what it's gonna be. Men in white coats pulling <clears throat> out augmentations like they are teeth. <sighs> Anyway, speaking of medical horrors, you ready for me to fix you or what? Yeah, let's go through that too. There won't be any surprises like last time. Last time I was surprised by your crazy tech. But now it's totally different. Now I know what's under that hood of yours. And you got me the tool I need. Changes everything. So what are you going to do exactly? I'm going to optimize your system. No more worrying about overheating. No more worrying about glitches. Jensen 2.0. Sounds pretty good, right? All right. Please tell me this is what a neuroplasticity calibrator looks like. That's the one! Okay, this won't take long, I promise. And don't worry, man. I never screw up two in a row spent a lot of time prepping for this one. Just try not to take anything. I don't recall if it's explained how these two 
met up. <clears throat> and the arrangement isn't all that surprising, in some ways, that... That wasn't so yeah. bad, right? How do you... That he wants to keep things secret, so Kohler fine. also wants to keep things secret, like so... I fixed you. Death to all your limits. Whatever implant you want to activate, you activate. Zero consequences. That sounds pretty good. Thanks, Kohler. I appreciate it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just get out there and make me proud. Go make use of all that cool shit. Okay. Come on. There we go. This is more so the one I'd want to use. I'm just... Yeah, sure. Yeah, and grab that too. I know, I tend, I don't really want to, um, go down to only two, but I just, you know, why not? I'll be able to get points back quickly enough, and those are, remote hacking, especially for how I've been playing, will be, will be useful. <clears throat> especially with the ability to knock out uh, drones and cameras at a distance. Oh, and actually, let me... Let me just check. Okay. Yeah. Did you s go see for yourself? Did you see that murder scene? Be arresting? Did you, see you know who? By now? Ah, Johnny. Orders are orders. Ah, it is not this doesn't control. concern you. We ah, can't Johnny. let them get away. You have anywhere. to tell us. What's your hurry? I Excuse me. The same order Please. The Did they send you to... Right? I recognize you. We're neighbors. I've seen you in our building. You're very difficult to miss. By chance, did someone send you to investigate? No, no one sent me. What happened here? It's horrible. An augmented woman was killed. Just outside of where we live. She looks like she was my age. Do you have any idea who she was? No. I've never seen her before. It's so sad that nothing will be done about this. Org victims are not high on the list of police priorities. To them, it's like a dog lying in the street. You... You're not a cop, are you? I was a cop, once. Old habits die hard. In America? Yeah, Detroit. It was a long time ago. I bet you have a lot of experience. You're used to this sort of thing. Mm, what about not you? quite. What's your interest in all this? Morbid curiosity? God, no. I want nothing more than to go home. Detective Montag, he's making me stay. He, he thinks I saw something. Did you see something? Maybe. I think I would rather not say, to be honest. Because if I had seen something, and if I started talking about it, wouldn't that put me in danger? You may not think much of the police here. I may not think much of them either. But that doesn't mean you should hold back information. They don't have it in them to protect me. They have neither the will nor the courage. Be that as it may, it's still probably your best hope for helping to catch the killer. I know. It's just that I don't trust the police. I would feel safer with someone like you. You have more reason to be invested in this than they do. You're augmented, like the victim was. And you look like you could actually protect me. It's not my case. But maybe you could help. Please, neighbor. 
Talk to Detective Montag. At least see how it's going. Make sure he doesn't think he's on vacation just because the victim is an orc. I'll talk to the officer in charge and see where he is with the investigation. If I can help him, I will. Thank you. Suppose I end up remembering something later. Is there a way for me to contact you? You planning to run off on me already? The first chance I get. There are times for standing in the cold, but this isn't one of them. I just want to go home, bolt the door, and never come out again. Of course, I will wait for Detective Montag to say it's okay first. And I'll still try to answer whatever questions you may have. I can give you access to my info link. You should feel free to use it if you have to. Thank you, neighbor. All right. What happened? How come she talks to him and not to me? So, Daria was actually talking to you, huh? I could barely get two words out of her. What did she say? What, how did we interact with him earlier? Pretty sure we did. Witness over there. She's... She's not sure yet. <laughs> how can she not be sure? Either she saw something or she didn't. She's scared. She thinks she might be in danger. I told her she'll be fine and that whoever did this would be caught. I'd like to believe that's true. Sure, so would I. But as you can see, the victim was like you. Augmented. That makes things a little more complicated, eh? Being a cop in this city, it's not always about doing the right thing. Or about doing things the right way. I was a cop for 12 years. I know all about getting bad orders. The difference between what you're told to do and what you know is right. Tell me about it. So, how did you reconcile yourself with uh, those kinds of orders? I quit. <laughs> I'm two months away from the beach. I'm not quitting. But I respect your idealism. It was a long time ago. I work for Interpol now. Interpol, huh? Listen, off the record, I've been told to forgo any unnecessary investigation. I want you to know, it's not my idea of how things should be done. Who told you to forgo the investigation? <sighs> Men who spend more time making policies than arrests. They want the victim's husband, Johnny Gunn, ex-PMC operator. Heavily augmented. All right, so if you're not comfortable with this, if you know things aren't being handled the way they should, why not do something about it? I thought I just did. Just because my hands are tied doesn't mean Interpol can't conduct a parallel investigation. Crime scene's right over there, and Johnny lives just a couple of blocks from here. Right. I never said I was going to work your case for you. Hey, sure you did. Isn't that more or less the promise you made your little friend over there? She won't talk to a cop because she doesn't trust us. Smart girl. Look, my orders are to arrest the husband. You take a look around, get to Johnny before my guys do, who knows? Maybe we'll actually learn something. I'll let you know what I find. Hi. Hey. Third. Careful of the evidence. Interpol. Oh, yeah, that's... Just because Monk can do that. And hey, I have gotten a uh, um <clears throat> should have gotten a point from that. Pretty obvious what happened here. Are you a journalist? No, but she was. He found something. She had enemies. I heard. I don't think he knows what he's doing. It was just a matter of time before they got her. Before who got her? She's that journalist. The one writing all those things about you know who. You'll have to fill me in. Radko Maximilian Perry? The local anti org politician? That's Angela Gunn lying there. She's the one that's been writing about him. As a weird a threat of a scandal and everything. Could. Coincidence?
I think this will get him talking more, so. I agree with the other point, but it's giving me more. exactly what I'm saying. Just, if you do that, please don't mention me. I don't want to end up like her. What else can you tell me about Radko? The guy's a sleazy piece of shit. That's all there is to it. And you think he's capable of murder? <clears throat> Absolutely. Did you actually see anything? I just got here, so I see what you see. A dead, augmented journalist. Thanks. Nope. Can't be anything in there. Go away from the crime. If it wasn't for Johnny, then I might have paid you for this. Something is going to push them into attacking us. Uh huh. It doesn't seem like there's anything useful here. Okay, that is pretty useful, but. Not, not, not for the specific mission. Oh, okay. For Johnny, and I might have paid you for this. Why? Here we go. These assholes. SP civilians. The only way I'm continuing this conversation is over a beer. You think I don't know what's going on here? Please, I can tell Isn't this where my place is? Just up there? Looks right. Because the door's still open. Okay. I'll hang on to that as my lethal alternative for when I might come to need it. What the... So I'm just getting a bunch of emails uh, right now that are um, the press releases, but it's just why am I getting them now? Should be fine. I just want to Okay, that's curious. Oh, duh. I, well, maybe. Which is, he said that the husband lives, like, just over there, and then it's telling me I gotta leave the entire district, but... No, going to that, I do have to just leave the district.
Oop. All right. Seriously. <clears throat> okay. Doing that. But seriously, I've gotten like four emails, just one after another. And I just, let me just, I, hang on. Okay, the Mix's Spring Games Showcase may have been going on, and that might be why, but she's kind of annoying. All right, so we'll be stopping this recording. Um, as I said, I just, I gotta get moving. Um, but I don't think that, I mean, I, I think, you know, th this one, the length is about right, anyhow. All right, so, uh, yeah, see you next time when I will basically cross the river and start talking to more people, including about this. See you then.